And now we can upgrade my mansion one more time. Got myself a little guard post, which obviously is going to be near the front to again keep the plebes out. Welcome back to Sim City, everyone. The last episode. I don't know what all happened. It's been moving pretty fast. We got another apartment level here. We're going to slowly convert all of this to a rich area. Oh, did I leave a few? No, those are medium density. They just look weird because they're not futurized. Anyway. Um, oh, and we built a hospital. And I'm hoping the hospital is going to work out for us, but I don't know yet. I'm going to have to wait and see how well the hospital can fix our health crisis. I should buy a wellness van. That would actually be very useful. So the wellness center, a van pops out of the wellness center every now and then, drives around and it, preemptively makes sick sims no longer sick. So that'll ease some pressure as well. We are also having a bit of a sewage crisis. And at this point, there's no reason for me to continue using sewage outflow pipes, we need to be using a standard um, sewage treatment plant. We need $64,000. We're a little short, but that's what we're saving up for right now. Oh yeah, and I moved into the city and my mansion got another upgrade. Yay! This is silly. This is just a time sink, to be perfectly honest, but it's a fun time sink, so who gives a crap, right? My own little, what is that? Oh, little balcony. Oh, just a balcony, okay. I mean, I can't reach it unless I get, go out the window, but you know, whatever. That's fine. Look upon your domain from here. Just be careful, it's the first place all the tomatoes get tossed. Oh, my people love me. Everything's fine. I mean, except, you know, those whose houses are flooded with poop, but we don't care about them. Uh, in fact, I'm going to be putting the sewage treatment plant over here in the poor area to make sure they stay poor. Which sounds horrible, but it's just game strategy. So I'm going to keep telling myself, oh, you know what? Since that's right here, let's add a... fair or a passenger station to the train. To the rails. There we go. I mean, no one's really gonna go there for a while. I guess having this... Oh, everyone's... What the hell? Whoa, where are you guys going? There's nowhere to go. I haven't hooked it up anywhere else. Where are you going to take the train to? Oh, yeah. I never did Maxis Manor. Well, crap. Let's do that, too, while we're sitting here doing nothing. 900 an hour. Oh, that's why I didn't do it. Yeah, let's just cancel that one. We'll do that one later. Or from a different city, I suppose. I had a lot of success doing, um, using Maxis Man in my gambling city. And if you, if, if you're a longtime fan of mine, or if you know which game I'm referencing with all of my city names, you know who's going to get the gambling city if I don't do a different person first. Um, I think that's going to be City 6, if I remember the order correctly. So, um, yeah. It, some of you know what's up. Some of you know what's up. Alright, so I'm going to upgrade these to high density just for the sake of consistency. I guess those are already high density. Yeah, there we go. I don't know where, they are, where they're going or what they're doing, but whatever. 146 riders a day. Where are you guys going? What are you doing? I mean, you. I can understand that you may commute, but you can't commute to Lock Island because they don't have a passenger train station. Although now I need to try to finagle one that would fit in there. Okay, we are almost... Whoa, what is this? Clean up your act. Reduce pollution. No thanks. <laughs> I'll do it later. What do you want? We should get some more garbage trucks. We're not getting to everyone. Okay. That is a legitimate complaint. We'll double our capacity. 
And it looks like our one incinerator has almost fully gotten our pollution under control. What, man? City is burning. There's fires everywhere. You tell me as you finish putting out the fire. Six out of ten fires. Seven out of ten fires extinguished. No buildings are burning. I mean, I guess I could give you guys another truck, but you seem to have this. Oh, you need upgraded, huh? Your density needs upgraded. I forgot about you guys. Completely forgot about you guys, but I don't have enough jobs in the city to make that worth it. We have so many unemployed poor people in this city, and Lock Island needs so many people there. I'm just going to leave this alone, because I'm happy with the level of poor people in Edgar's Castle right now. Okay, guest house. Hmm. <laughs> Like, even though it doesn't matter, I'm just thinking if I put the guest house here or here, I won't be able to see the highway from my balcony, so I don't want to put it there. So I'm going to put it here. Because <laughs> I also didn't want to put it over here where it could block or get in the way of my driveway. Even though none of that mattered, I cared enough that, that's what, that, that was my thought process behind that whole situation. Alright, and oh, I still have some rubble? Ah, uh, that must have been from the meteor strikes, I bet. There's one more somewhere. Oh, there it is. Building fire. Five abandoned buildings, but those will eventually fix themselves. Okay. Hey, look, all black icons across the board. How long has it been since we've seen that? And we are pulling a... Oh, yeah, we've got $1,000 profit so far from the Mega Tower today. And the day is almost done, and obviously there's more to do. Why did this turn... What the hell? What is going on with all the blinkies? All the blinkies are confusing me. Okay, so... Where's the worker level? Come on, where's the office level? Where is it? Where is it? Where's the office level? There it is. Yeah, we still need a lot more rich people. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to convert all of this to richy rich people. And the way I'm going to do that is we're going to destroy the parks I have and replace them with high-value parks. Which, again, in the short term, this is going to kind of suck. Because what's going to happen is in the short term, all these people are going to move out and be unhappy. Um, and in the medium term, we're actually going to take a population hit since there will be fewer wealthy people who move in than, uh, medium wealth people, but, let's see, how big is this? Oh, Jesus. Let's see. This is not exactly working out how I wanted it to work out. I don't want to take out those buildings if I... Oh, oh, I can just put put it here. Perfect. And then this one I can just manually expand. Okay. And then up here I could do that. Where's that plaza? Uh, could be better. Let's alter it. Need that nice bright blue. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. And what are you guys upset about? That's not the sewage, that's the water. You guys don't like the water pumping station? Alright, well, I'll offset that too. We've got the money. Okay. Oh, these buildings are abandoned. That's not helping. Yeah, I saw that. 
All right, let's just destroy those. Usually, again, I don't manually destroy abandoned buildings because they will fix themselves, but I suppose it makes sense that it would damage the property value. Yeah, okay, and then everyone's getting rich again over here. And then we can further help ourselves. Can I place a park here? It says I can't, but guess what? I know how to mess with the system to allow me to do so. Wait, I don't want to take that much, just in case I need to expand the water. But at just that amount, it will be enough that we can do that. Haha! -ha! Now all that place is richy rich. So the only part that's medium wealth is this chunk here. And yeah, it's worth it. It's worth it destroying that bit. No, wait, no, it's not. No, I'm going to leave that medium wealth. I don't want to destroy those houses. That looks really nice. Okay. So now the wealth, the super rich are moving into this section too. And again, we've taken our population hit and our budget hit. We're only making 3,000 an hour now. What is with the freaking poop, man? Did I never build it? Oh, I never built it. Okay, God. I was, all right, hold on. There's too much happening now. Too much happening. All right, we're gonna stick the sewage treatment plant here. This is gonna upset some people. I don't care about them because they're poor. And then we're going to destroy these. Cool, okay. So now back to sewage. We have an excess of 25, which I think means we're even treating it all how we need to treat it. Yellow, yellow, yellow. Holding. Cool. All right, that solves that problem. And now we can upgrade my mansion one more time. Got myself a little guard post, which obviously is going to be near the front to, again, keep the plebes out. Because, oh, that looks really kind of weird. You know what? I should put that on the other side. I need to put it on this side so the guard has full vision of what's going on on the land in case he needs to tackle somebody. Cool. All right, then. All right. See, we're in good shape. Everything's doing fine. How's garbage collection now going? Hmm, looks like we got to just about everyone except the pores. The original poor is an old town. Oh, you're ready for another upgrade? Or not. You were blinking at me for some reason, though. Yeah, get that garbage. Yeah, we're good. We're fine. Say everything's fine. And all you, all you blazing hawks doubted me. Actually, probably none of you doubted me. Well, maybe a few of you doubted me, but hey. The point is, we're in good shape. Everything's going fine. Oh, I love this map. Such a, such a great map. Oh, they're getting the little tiny bits of trash now. Why did you guys leave that one house? Oh, because it was on fire. That made sense. All right. Yeah, there we go. We've got pretty much everything in hand. I'm thinking about adding another garage anyway, just to ensure that we've got it, because it's getting a little late. I think they stopped collecting trash at like six. I wonder if they have to collect trash from the tower. I don't know if they have to. There's something really zen about watching the little bars go away to me. It's nice to kind of watch this. It's very peaceful. Oh, he got it. He got all that trash there. Wow, I think they got everything. So, yeah, they got it all. Cool. All right, I don't need any more trucks. Excellent. And it does seem like the incinerator, just one incinerator is keeping up with it. Awesome. Okay, cool. We are in good shape. 
And then I just noticed I see green lines here. I bet you that is profitability. The office level is not as bright of a green as the apartment levels, which probably means they are not giving me as much money. So apartment level one. Come on, baby. Apartment level one. 9,600 profit yesterday. Today it's 84. Apartment level five. 10,000 profit. 11,000 yesterday. And then my office, yep, it's not at full because we need more rich people. 31,000 profit today, 35,000 profit yesterday. But that's a lot of money overall, man. That is a lot of money. Lots of cash. And the reason it's not higher is because I'm having to pay for the education level and the park level as well. The education level is worth its money, though. It's teaching 1,600 students. The university is teaching only 119. Jeez, that's almost not even worth it. Okay, we are in good shape. Further, we have 55,000 people in the city, and if we go to the Great Works site again, I need 58,000 to be able to buy the Arcology. So we just need a few more people, and then we're good to go. It seems the tower is not letting us get rich people. However, I wonder if the Elite Tower does let us do that. I mean, that's why it's called Elite, after all. Massive population, more workers, more shoppers. Mall level, medium tech. I bet you it does. I would almost guarantee you that these towers can give me the stronger, because okay, here's what I'm thinking. So this is a standard mega tower, right? So the standard mega tower came with an apartment level of low, val of low wealth. That's what that thing up at the top shows. Mega tower with apartment level, low wealth. So, but it allows me to build one that's one level higher of wealth. So it came with this, but it allowed me to build this. So in theory, if the game is consistent, if I make an elite tower with a medium wealth apartment level, maybe it also allows me to then add a high wealth tower level to bring in more people as well. And that would make not only a ton of sense, but it also solves the problem I had with the academy. In my side file, it was almost impossible for me to get enough rich people in one city to get the academy functional. But the academy was introduced with these mega towers in the same expansion. So I wonder if they're supposed to work together, if they're supposed to play together, so to speak. It would totally make sense. So what I want to do is when I can afford it, and I guess it's going to have to be in the next session since this one is the last episode of this session, I should probably build a mega tower with a mall level for 245000 and then see if I can add a high, wealth dis a high wealth level of apartments on top of it. So that'll be our next goal. Now, I wasn't going to spend this much time with Edgar's castle. I was just going to dump a bunch of people here and be done with it. But it seems that this is a pretty good place to work on this stuff because we are making a fairly solid profit, almost 4000 an hour. I think my taxes are still yeah, 10%. But it won't take us very long to make $45,000 more dollars. Um, per hour, that's, what, uh, to, to, uh, 11 more hours, well, 12 more hours, and we'll have it. Um, which is not very long in SimCity time. You can see how fast the clock's moving there. So, there's really not much more to do at the moment, unless I need to solve problems, which apparently I do still have problems. Fire service is slow. Dude... <laughs> I don't know what to do about this other than giving you another truck because I'm not giving you I'm not building a fire district because we don't need one we don't need that many is that what you're advising me to do your trucks couldn't get to a fire because before it burned a building down is that true I don't see any buildings that are burned down I see a few abandoned buildings I don't see anything that's actually abandoned or rubbled so you are just a complainy Chelsea I don't know complainy Delaney there we go hopefully now you are named Delaney sports car garage 
Yeah. Oh, we're gonna put that right next to the guard tower. Better keep my Camaro Z28 in one piece or I will punch you. It's my favorite car. I'll never own one. Anyway, um... But yeah, so we've got our plan of attack here for Edgar's castle. We're doing very well, so next time we play, we will know exactly what we need to do. We just need to save up some cash, build a new mega tower, get some rich people involved, maybe even drop the academy, and Edgar's castle will be the pinnacle of the Ultima region. I can't wait. Damn, I'm having a lot of fun with this. If you're having a lot of fun with this too, and you enjoy what I do, please consider donating to Patreon because I need your support. Right now, every dollar you're, you would be willing to donate to me, and you can donate for as little as a dollar a month, is going to my grocery bill, and it would make a huge difference in my life if you can do that. Regardless, I'm still going to keep doing what I do as to the best of my ability, but um, you'll uh, you get a few other benefits from from subscribing or yeah i guess subscribing to patreon through me uh, because you will also get first uh, look at what games we play for streaming sundays um and with higher levels there are other optional bonuses you can get as well so check out the patreon page in the link in the video description and yeah other than that um I do thank you for your views, and I am eager for the next session because I'm enjoying SimCity a lot. I think I'm actually enjoying this more than I did last time, which is kind of strange. I don't know why. I don't know why I'm enjoying it more. Maybe just because I'm more relaxed and I know the game isn't as hardcore as some people wanted it to be. I don't know. Plus, the Mega Tower is really cool. Anyway, that'll do it for today's session. Tomorrow will probably be Monster Rancher 3. We'll do something for eight days, and then we'll be right back to SimCity. So thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you tomorrow for another episode.